Hello, my loves. How are you? I hope you're getting up, getting out, and getting into something. I hope so. This here, right here, baby. This be me, Mama Roxy says. I'm here for your wallet, your purses, and your pocketbooks. Baby, your hearts and your minds. What it is, what it be like, and everything. For all my babies out there that is getting the best of that snowstorm. Ooh, take it easy. Drive slow. Keep you some water, some blankets, some food, and all the supplies that you may need inside your vehicle as you're moving and rotating. So just in case you come at a standstill, you will be warm. You will have the necessities and things that you need. And if you got kids, oh golly, make sure you got blankets, extra coats, socks, um... Make sure you got flashlights. Make sure you got games. Make sure you got coloring pads and coloring pencils and snacks and everything. But the main thing is be safe. Drive slow. Respect others that's out there because you don't know what nobody else is going through. You feel me? And for those that's getting ready to get the snow, let's dress up, be warm, and be happy. Yes. But as for me today, I am sitting here on this beautiful Friday. I don't know when you're going to get this video. What the fuck is stuck on the bottom of my I'm sorry, y'all. Well, something irritating me. I'd be like, what the fuck? But anyway, yes. Um, I've been out a little bit today. I got a little change. I had to make a... She in purchase and a lot of my other grandbabies, their things are coming from she in. So I had to do that. That was a $269. I ain't got no money type of, but I did it anyway type situation. You got to get them ready. But at the same time, I have been out trying to find other little resources to help because i got 11 grandbabies at certain times it all depends on if my oldest daughter fiance baby mama let her see the other kids then that means i got 14 of them or well, really 15 so and i actually got let me see how i can say this um it, it don't matter. They all mine. I don't care if they step, whatever it is, they all mine. I don't treat none of them no different than I would any other ones. You know what I'm saying? So, with that being said, when you're on that little fixed income, you got 14 kids. You got two daughter-in-laws. You got two son-in-laws. You got, oh my God, your four kids. That's a lot of freaking people to try to... And then I got to send my mom something. And then I got my, my sister, Denise, and Mike. And you know what I'm saying? It's, this is hard. Uh, so I make do, baby. I find all my little resources that I think I could find. I um, Here, they got a, uh, a Salvation Army of like a toy spot where you can go register it. I'm quite sure. I don't know if everyone has them. But I do know that here in Michigan, we have them and you can go register up and you can get used toys and maybe like two or three new toys. But whatever you get, you can always sanitize them, clean them and get them something because um, it's something that they ain't had. So they, they do them appreciate it. If they don't, then you know next time that they don't get nothing. Okay. But. It is what it is. But in the process of getting out, spending that little money, uh, I try to find as many deals and as many things as I can. So I know everybody is into gaming. I'm going to do the little Walmart. I did a Walmart grocery haul. So this is just going to be Walmart and Dollar Tree. So I know that all my little grandbabies, everybody into gaming you know on the computer on the phone they ps4s they whatever the case may be so i saw this and this is the gamer skills and it was originally 424 
and I got it for a dollar. I got four of these, and this is what it looks like in the, it's by Pen and Gear. And this is what it looks like in the inside. Every little bit counts. Um, my uh, my my grandson Davion, he is writing a book, so that most definitely will come in handy with him. So I got five of those. Even my granddaughter Aaliyah is a gamer. She she's a gamer too. So these little books, all these little things, they come in handy, baby. I even ran across one where whoever is into Harry Potter, I got a Harry Potter set. And I love that. So then, you know, like I told you, any little bitty thing and every little bitty thing counts. Um, she loves these things. It's just stuff on everything. I told you, this came with my groceries. And... But this is what this looks like right here. And it comes with these little chokers that she likes. So I got this one. I thought I had another one. And everybody can get a little cup. And these right here are the color changing camo. Uh, Tumblr straw set. It's a four pack. So everybody can get a little cup. You can put like a little toy in there. You can put some candy in there. You can put something in there that that they will like. But everybody can get a cup. I got that set right there. And this little set right here. I like this little camo look. I don't think they all the same. Oh, yes, they are. Yes, they are. Let's take them a little so we can see what they look like. Okay. Because I want to be guessing. I swear, when I want to get something to lose, I can't. When I ain't trying to get nothing to lose, I tear up everything. So we got the green camo, the purple camo, the blue one. Uh oh. This one is like a teal. And then you got the purple one. So, these are what these look like. Everybody can get a color changing um, thing. You know what I'm saying? Put put a little toy in there. Put up some peppermints or some chocolate or something. And, and make it into a stock, a stock and stuffer. You feel what I'm saying? Everybody got some. <laughs> so, you know. We're not going to the store. And my whole 267 almost $300 went to my grandbabies. I ain't about me nothing. You know how hurt I was? Do you know how hurt I was? But anyway, I went to Walmart. I, You know, it cost me 80 between $80 to $85 to go get my nails done and redone. I just broke this one. <laughs> And it cost me $85. I don't have the $85 right now. Um, this is the time for giving. So I'm trying to give more than I do receive. So, but I did give me these, honey. <laughs> I'm spending some on myself. I got me some LA Colors. Uh, lavish Nails Boo Boo. Boo Boo. <laughs> I'm going to cut them down to make them like these. I don't like the point. You scratch up the cuckoo mama like that. I like my cuckoo mama clean and unscratched. I don't care what you say. So, but in the process, like I said, I bought everything else for everybody I had. Like, a good $25 for myself. For myself. So, in the process of having that... I had to buy more paper towels because I clean with paper towels all the time. So I got me some sparkle, baby. Get it clean, honey. And this right here is tear, tear a square. More choices, more value. This is our towels are 100% backyard composable. You know, I can't even talk right now. But yeah. So. I was like, okay, if I want to go out this weekend, what I want to wear. You know, I hear my phone, but I don't see it. So, I wanted to go out this weekend. Oh! <laughs> I 
anyway i'm just saying i don't have a ride <laughs> but anyway baby so i wanted to wear i wanted these um these jeans right yeah, like you coming to get me Hold on, y'all. This is my friend. You meet so many people when you go out. <laughs> yes, that's my friend. His name is Jeff. He he is a friend. He's married. But he is the most amazing dancer. Y'all, y'all gotta meet him. I'm gonna I'm gonna introduce him to y'all. But anyway, I wanted some pants. This color to wear with these boots. But I could not find none nowhere but I'm gonna throw me on some blue jeans and I got a perfect jacket to match these and it's going with this bag <laughs> and my jacket is the perfect jacket for it but baby the inside of the jacket is orange and match the shoes and the, and the bag but the inside of the jacket is orange so honey I went on the men's section. <laughs> Padow, boo boo, honey. I'm gonna put me a little cup right here, you know, put like, bam, what you see, what you see, what you see, G. Yeah, <laughs> that's what I'm wearing. This right here. And this is just a man's hoodie. It's the athletic wear. And this was $9.99. So that was part of my little $10, my little $20. Hold on. I am here and ready. <laughs> I say laugh out loud. Laugh, okay. <laughs> okay. So then, hold on, hold on. Wait a minute. Let me show what else mama got up in it. So then, when I go out tomorrow night, hmm. I'm wearing my black leather pants. I'm wearing my uh, either some black leather boots or some black suede boots and my black suede purse. And this leather top right here. And this feels buttery soft, y'all. And let that out. Let that out. Just let that hang right here. And you got the little squeeze. It's like a bag though, don't it? <laughs> but I liked it. And it was by Terry. It's by Terry. Scott. It feels so soft. It was. It's This one is a 1X. And it was $24.98. And I got it for $11. So count that up. That's $20. That's $21 to be exact. That's, that's what my money went on today. For me. Hold on, I just want to see if it's going to be too big. But I'm telling you, this was some little nice tights. I got the leather leggings. Well, this may be too big. I could just like, this kind of cute though. I should have got it in a small. You can't cinch up. Can you cinch it up? You can kind of cinch that up. On around. Hold on. I'm trying to cinch it up. So... But it ain't showing enough cleavage for me. But this how this look though. Let me get up. This right here. It's a little too big for me. But honey, with my nice little tight pants on, and I probably can take it and I don't know, do something with it if I don't tuck it. But this is kind of cute. I should have got it in a small. Not a small, but I didn't know it was going to be this big. But then, you can always put on you a pretty little black bra. Honey, put you a little black bra on. Let's unloosen that some. Yeah, unloosen it. And put you a pretty little black bra or bodysuit on or something. And let that hang like that. Say what? <laughs> Listen. Don't cut up with me, because I cut up with you, honey. I cut up with you. But anyway, let's get up off of that. He just texted me back. This is my friend. 
Yes, it's snowing here too. It's all about safety. I say it's all about safety, my baby. <laughs> but this is this this is kind of cute. I like the way it flow with your little tight pants on, honey, and just let that just. Okay, y'all. Let me let's move on to Dollar Tree. I'm gonna keep it on. I just want y'all to see that it's on. You know, it's so soft and really. And I got leather pants too. We gonna get off this, but I got some patent leather pants that's real, real shiny. But I was gonna wear it tomorrow with my little patent leather. I got patent leather pants. They tight. Yeah, they tight, baby. They tight. <laughs> with these boots right here, the pants is just like the boots. You know, just like this. With this, and I got this pretty sequin shirt. That ain't got no squeeze on it. Damn, I just got it from over here. Why won't you go back? Anyway, with this little sequin shirt with like a suit jacket. Girl, I already got my plan. I've been laying in my bed thinking about it. Like, honey. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm so rude. But, I'm, yeah, I don't know. But let's get into it. I'm sorry. I must apologize. You know, by me having that dog, I do not like smells. This right here is the Pet Fresh Carpet Odor Eliminator. I really like this by Arm & Hammer. It really kills the dog smell and everything. I told you I didn't got so I didn't train my baby when she walked. I got a carpet outside. So when she walk in, she know how to get left paw, right paw, give it to me. And she wiped her feet. But this right here, I got me two of those. And it got OxyClean Dirt Fighter in there. So her butt is getting so big. Till, I swear to God, she can drink about one bottle of water every time she get ready. She can drink a bottle of water. And I got her some bigger bowls. And these are right here. And these are called the pos Positive Vibes. So I had to get this. The other little bowl had gotten too little for us. She too big for this. But y'all know, every now and then, I do like sweets. And even though I had that gastric bypass surgery, let me tell y'all what I did. For, for Thanksgiving, I had cooked all the sweets, but I made them to the point where I can kind of eat some of them. And like sweet potato pie, and I use brown sugar, and I use less of the sugar, and it was more cinnamon, but it was real good and buttery. It was very good. But my son had brought some of these peanut butter coconut donuts. Oh my good googly moogly. So before I could eat any sweets, what I would have to do is I would really have to literally eat and then mix the sweets in with the food. And then it wouldn't help. But this particular day, hard-headed as hell, not paying no attention, y'all. I ate a whole freaking donut. Oh, my God. I hadn't had that much sweets. That sugar rush hit me. My head was spinning. My body was hurting. I was actually sick for six days. Not six days, but two days. I will never, ever do that again. So when I eat something... I eat real light with real light. This right here in this whole bag, it got a total gram of sugar is nine, and it got the included uh uh it got two more grams of nine, so it's like eighteen percent of sugar in here in the whole bag. The other had like thirty six <laughs> pieces of sugar, y'all. I don't know what the hell I was thinking. I I wasn't. I won't do that no more. So this right here is the Nature's Garden Delicious Tasty Tropical Fruit Trail Mix. This one don't have no nuts in there, you know. I can't eat nuts. They they hurt the teeth. So this is a blend of banana chips, raisin, dried papaya, dried pineapple, and dried coconut. The sugar level in this motherfucker right here is 15. 
but that's in every it ain't in every bag it's in the whole thing so i have to gradually eat these little packs and you get how many little packs? you get four little individual packs in here so i might have a pack of these maybe once a day one a day or I may eat two, maybe whatever the case may be. You have to really eat it real lightly. So this one right here is the Tropical Fruit Trail Mix. This one got 15 grams of sugar in here as well. But it's mixed in with the nuts. You have to suck on the nuts to make them soft in order to eat them. In order for me to eat them. Now when I talk to y'all, I have to give y'all the look. Because... I'm talking about food. I'm a nasty old woman. You already know that. Don't 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 act like you don't know that. But anyway, and I got a I got a comment. Somebody said, "Um, Mama Roxy, I like everything else you're doing, but I don't appreciate the fact that you put your dog outside on the chain." Listen, let me tell you something about my dog. My dog's chain is only for when it's snow outside. And my old butt can't leave and go follow her down that hill because I've slid. I, I done broke out of hip. Out of my hip then broke. I'm not doing it no more. So I let her. She the, the chain is long enough for her to run back and forth all through the yard. Do what she got to do. And I done see where she didn't poop that. When I bring her in the house, she ain't outside long enough on no chain. And you can't just let her run the yard because she would run the yard. And she's so big and she looks so much like a pit. He would be afraid and probably would hurt her. So she cannot run my yard. My yard is not closed off enough for her to just run the yard. So she has to have a chain when she's out there by herself. And the only time she's on a long long leashy chain is when it's cold outside and i can't make them steps with her because she will pull my old ass down that hill and she will come back like she did before and she will see me getting up and she will knock me back down again she knocked me down twice so yes i do put her on the chain and let her go out there and handle her business and when i hit that door like that she come right on back we wipe her feet she come in the house she eat her food and i go out there and i pick up the poop but i can't do it when it's in the winter time with all the snow and the ice because i refuse to go back down and that was answering your question <laughs> so this is my other little bag i got me one out because i needed a little snack today and it's actually pretty good i bought my friend sister had her baby so i got her some little things and i had to give her a little baby bag to put all her cute little stuff in and this was the only cute little baby bag that they had for a little girl so i got that and i got her the little tissue paper to go inside with i got that I got some more gel stuff. I wish I would have got the real because I used the super super glue, but I used the gel piece. But one what I hate about the gel piece is you see that you see the white it pops up on the nail up at the top right there, and I don't like that. I got me some of that. They only had these color poop bags. I'm picky, picky about poop bags. But I keep poop bags because I keep one. I got I got two coats that I wear out to take her out to go poop in, and they each got a bag, a bag, a bag in there. Cause I don't go without, I don't go nowhere without it. So I got me some 15 piece trident, and y'all, batteries are getting very scarce to find in Dollar Tree. So I got me two of these. These are the triple A, the double A ones, and I got me, no, I got three. I guess. I got me three of these, the double A ones, and I got the triple A's. I think I got two of them. Nope. Yep, I got two of those. They are getting very scarce. And all the dang on Christmas lights that you need <laughs> calls for these batteries right here. And the number C, number C batteries. Yeah, that's what they calls for. But this has been my long Dollar Tree. My long dollar tree and walmart haul i think this is it baby wait yep that's this is it 
This is it, y'all. And I got her some cute little baby stuff. Hold on, y'all. Listen. Check it out. Look at this. Ain't this cute? That is so cute. It say dream on. Got a fozy dude. Get it ready to put in a little bag. And then this one right here, that I just thought was so cute. This is you, me, and a big hug with the little pants, with the little feet and stuff in there. She got that. She got this right here. Yes. So, it takes, the baby shower been a while ago. But when you ain't got no money. You got to get stuff when you can. A beautiful little princess. That one. That one. And that one. You got to get stuff when you can, y'all. Listen. I know some people get on here and they act like you sitting here on this YouTube channel and you really making something. I ain't. I, um. I, I've, I think the highest I've made on my YouTube channel so far is $200. That's the highest I've made ever on here. I don't, I don't make no money. And I'm going to tell you, you only going to get that $200 or that your threshold amount is $100. And if you ain't made, if you didn't got to the middle, if you didn't got like this month, and the checks come out on the 21st of every month. If you ain't made a hundred dollars within that month, then you, you don't get that money until they until it until it until they go over. You feel me? So that's how that go. But I still like to get on here and do my thing. Because it's not about the money that I'm making, it's about the people that I'm reaching and the conversations that I'm having and all that stuff like that. that that's what that's about to me. That's what that is about to me. It's about that. And giving what you can, doing what you can, all of that. that that's what it's about with me. Um, I like it. I like knowing the fact that the things that come out of my mouth, somebody like. Um, sometimes I offend somebody, sometimes I don't. Sometimes somebody be like, you know what, I really need to hit it. And I'm so happy about that. I am so happy that you needed to hit it. I'm so happy that I was able to get it and bring that to you. So, yes, yes, ma'am. I, I love what I do. I wish I was getting some YouTubers get bank. But, honey, they've been doing it for so much longer than me. And they have so more, so many, I can't even talk a lot more subscribers and content than I have. So, you can't get mad. You can't get upset. You can't do none of that. Only thing you could do is just thank God for each and every day. I, I love what I do. I love sitting here talking to you. If the mo my videos that makes in, that it brings in the most are videos like this. Videos when I got something to show y'all. Uh, or my when I made the sweet potatoes that that was a big video and for that video for itself making a hundred I mean a thousand subscribers a thousand views that was eight dollars yes that was eight dollars so some of you get some money some of them some of them get a lot of money some of them don't it all depends on how it's running that's why I do things the way I do things it is what it is. But I love you guys. Happy holidays and ciao. I am really feeling my little shirt. It's a little too big. My little. little. But you know what? I'm going to rock it anyway. I'm going to make it do what it do for me, boo. I love y'all and ciao.